Okay guys, so our friends at Air Gun Depot sent us an Air Force Condor SS to review. So today I'm going to be taking and unboxing and assembling it. So first up we have inside of the baggie here our tools to assemble the gun. the operations manual, a warranty card, the Air Force catalog, and an operations DVD. Next up we have the air tank. and the gun itself. All right, to start assembly, you'll first take this pouch, open it up. There are three tools inside, a small Allen key, a large Allen key, and a wrench. Next, you'll want to take and set your air tank up like so. Grab your air gun, Use the small Allen key to unscrew the Allen screw located right here until the screw is just proud. Then you'll want to take the gun, set it like so, and begin turning the collar. And this takes a little bit of time to get everything lined up just right with the threads. Sometimes it's willing to cooperate, sometimes it won't. Yep. And you want to keep on turning until it gets hand tight. All right, that's hand tight. Now you'll take your wrench, place it in, and give it just a little bit of a turn to snug it up. And then you'll want to take and tighten this screw back down. That's it. The air gun has been assembled. Now this large Allen screw is used to adjust the butt plate here. If you want to change the length of pull on the gun, you just loosen these screws. Pull this whole clamp assembly back to whatever length you want, and then retighten them. And so that's how you assemble the Air Force Condor SS.